everyone, Lewis here, and I'm going to show you how to transfer Pokemon from Pokemon Go into Pokemon Home and the titles that are compatible with Pokemon Home. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. When transferring Pokemon into Pokemon Home from Pokemon Go, the Pokemon must not be favored, and it can't be a spindent either. As of this recording, Hoopa, which was recently released into Pokemon Go, cannot be transferred into Pokemon Home at the moment. But that might change in the future. The same with Spinda. For this video, I'll be not only showing you footage that I shot with my phone, but also footage I shot from the Nintendo Switch as well. First off, what you're going to do is make an account with Nintendo at their website, then on iOS, Android, or Switch. You want to install the app, then go into settings, scroll down till you see the option that says Pokemon Home, then enter your Nintendo log in info, and then fire up Pokemon Home on either your phone, tablet, or Switch. I just transferred seven Alolan Pokemon, some Rattata, an Executor, and a Diglett. You get a confirmation message telling you that you received Pokemon from Pokemon Go. You have the option to decline, but if you want them, hit yes, then they'll end up in the default box. Now the Pokemon I transferred, most of them can't be transferred into Pokemon Sword or Shield, but in 2022, you'll be able to transfer Pokemon from Go to Home, then into Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl, or Legend Arceus. Once Pokemon have been transferred from Pokemon Go to Pokemon Home, like with the Let's Go games, they can't be transferred back to Pokemon Go. And if you are on iOS or Android, you can't use the mobile version at the same time as the Switch version. Pokemon can only be traded with other trainers in the mobile version, as well as Pokemon that are released. And of course, there are premium plans for more boxes to store more Pokemon. Also, when transferring Pokemon, using transport energy takes days to recharge, depending if it's a legendary, mythical, or normal shiny, or shiny that is a legendary or mythical Pokemon. You can also charge it up using your Pokecoins too. And of course, when it comes to transferring Pokemon from Pokemon Go into these games, there will be some instances where you can't put the Pokemon from Pokemon Home into those games unless you have that Pokemon already on your save file and registered into that game's Pokedex, like legendary such as Xanica or Zemazenta, which were released during Ultra Unlock Part 3 featuring Pokemon such as those two from Sword and Shield versions. Thanks for watching everyone! You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. And remember, it's time for adventure! Also, during these times when heading out, wear a mask in indoor public settings, practice social distancing, wash your hands, carry hand sanitizer with you, most importantly, get vaccinated, and lastly, stay safe, be healthy and together. We are finally getting through these dark times together, but we're not out of the woods just yet.